Right, that's what I want to talk about today, my hand switch. <music> Meanwhile, yeah, I have become known for using this hand switch yeah, very often. From my point of view, this is not a good sign because yeah, it is an absolute emergency shot. Yeah, but since I have become a little bit slower over the years, I now have yeah, to help myself out relatively often with it. But how did it come to this? Yes, really out of emergency. I can still remember the final of the German Open quite a few years ago against, I think it was... The... Holy shit. <laughs> Nochmal. I can still remember yeah, the final of the German Open quite a few years ago against Chuan Chi Yuan. It was a very even match until the middle of the third set. I had the feeling that Chuan was yeah, more aggressive than I was and controlled the game. At 5-6 I was taken off a serve and yeah, my frustration was quite big. But then came this big point when I used this hand change for the first time. Chuan was yeah, pretty perplexed and I suddenly got the upper hand and won the final 4-1. That's my first memory of my hand switch. And after that, of course, there were some yeah, quite few nice points with it. Mostly I have to smile a bit when it works out because I don't really feel confident with it. Overall, my movement is already very stiff, but I pay particular attention to the right rhythm and also a clean grip change, which is yeah, pretty crucial because there is usually not much time. Here in slow motion, how the process of changing the grip should go. Of course, I try to switch back to my strong left hand immediately afterwards. So don't look too long after the ball and hope that it somehow lands on the table. But the opponent is very often surprised, even the best like Ma Long for example. Have fun here with a little compilation. Get it. 